Hello, everybody. I wanted to show you how to use the um, Mendeley web installer, web importer, and um, the Mendeley desktop, and also how to use it with Word documents to create citations. So here we are at the UO Libraries page. I want to go to um, the Hyphy Research Guide. I have to scroll down. Human Physiology. Here it is. And I'm going to select PubMed. It's going to open up another tab, PubMed. I'm going to do a sex differences and ACL injuries. So make that sex differences. And then um, I want to get this into my Mendeley library. Here's how I go about doing it. Go to Mendeley, sign in. And then um, you might get something the first time that pops up. Uh, if not, let's see if we go to the library now, if it will ask me about that. It is not asking me about that. So let's go back to the feed. If I go down to the bottom of the page, and it's a little bit strange how it goes down to the bottom of the page. It takes a few times trying to get that reference manager web importer citation plugin. So I'm going to do the web importer. And it will know that I'm in Chrome. I'm using Chrome. I'm going to install the Chrome browser extension. I'm going to add it to Chrome. I have this, um, this blocker, and so I'm going to add the extension. And now it's right there. So when I go to this page and I want to save some of these articles, click on that extension. And here, comparison of injuries by Larukusain, factors associated with the status of meniscal tears, there's there, epidemiology, um, it looks like the epidemiology Epidemiology is here, so for some reason these are being skipped. Let's add this one. Larukasane. Larukasane. I'm going to save that. Now, if I go to Mendeley my, and my library, go to my library, I should quickly see that Larukasane article. And there it is. Okay, terrific. So just by adding this nice little um, web importer. OK, next thing I need to do is go to my Mendeley desktop. You might need to download it. And to download it, um, again, remember, I went to the feed. And I went to the bottom of the page. And um, might have to do it a couple times. And I click on that reference manager. And it will um, give me something that this download Mendeley desktop. And I do that, add it to my applications file in, uh, for a Mac and for a PC. I'm not exactly sure how it goes. Then I get this um, desktop after it syncs, which I have to do. Um, here's that LaRucasane article. So it's ready to go. Now I can select it. And um, on a Mac, I hit Control. And it lets me copy as a formatted citation. You have to see what um, the citation style is. Right now I'm using American Medical Association. Let's change it to American Psychological Association, or APA. So copy as a formatted citation. I'm going to go to Microsoft Word, where I have documents already open. I'm going to open the new document. And there it is, formatted in APA. Here's the other thing that I can do. For Mendeley Desktop, I can also go to Tools. And this says uninstall MS Word plugin because it's already installed. If it wasn't already installed, it would say install MS Word pl plugin. I'd have to close Word, and then it would let me do it, and it would tell me that it was successful. It's fairly straightforward. But it's right now it's installed. 
so I can go back to Word. And now um, I can say sex differences and ACL. And let's see if I can get reference for that. Insert or edit citations. Here's that Lyricosane article. Let's see if I can get ACL. Here's another ACL article that I'm going to cite there. So I can cite two things. There's one and two. At the end of my paper, I references, insert bibliography, and there, there it is. In order to change the format, all I have to do is select it and change the style. And there you see now, instead of having the names, it has the numbers. Okay, let's look at what this looks like on Chrome. Here I am at the Hyphy Research Guide. Go to PubMed. This is still Chrome. How lovely. Let's see what it looks like on Safari. So you go libraries. Um, I go to um, I go to my research guides. Med again. X differences. And I need to, um, I want to save something to Mendeley. So again, I'm on a different browser now. I'm going to sign in to Mendeley. Perhaps you'll get one of these where you um, go when you go to um, your Mendeley library and it says I can install the web importer plugin. So install that now. So now in Safari, I have to take this button and drag it to my favorites bar. My favorites bar isn't being viewed right now. So I need to show favorites bar in the view tab, view tab, show favorites bar. I get this lovely bar and then I literally click on the Save to Mendeley button so it becomes this cross. And then I drag that little app Java applet up here. It says Save to Mendeley. If you don't have enough space, you can just say Mendeley if you'd like. Now when I go to PubMed and I click on that, I get that same thing that I got with the Chrome extension. And it's taking a little while. Again, here's this article. Here's that article. Let's save one of them. And so that's by Filippi. If I go to my library, Gives me a little things. Here's the Felipe article. Okay, last but not least, Firefox. Here I am in Mendeley. And I want to add the web importer. So um, I want to allow to install the software. And it has to be restarted. A little bit different process, same idea. And now in Firefox, it has this little, this little extension, just like it does in Chrome. So if I were to go to your libraries and I go to the research guide again, Go to PubMed. Sex differences. And I click on Mendeley. 